Welcome aboard, folks. I'm Admiral Bisque, and today we're going to be playing Sonic Lost Adventure Havoc Harbor. This is a uh, fan made Sonic game that I found on Game Joel, and uh, I'm a really huge Sonic fan. I know I've said that before in Paper Thin, and uh, you know, I figured, you know what, let me go ahead and play a Sonic game. One of the ones I found, I found a bunch of them on Game Joel, and a lot of them that I want to check out. Um, and this is the one I'm going to start with, because this one looks really good, and I've heard good things off of Game Jolt mostly. But, um, yeah, I'm really excited. This looks really good, and I'm going to check it out. So let's, uh, let's, uh, go ahead and just, uh, play. Oh, we got save slots. Okay, uh, let's go with the first one. What the? What is this? Let's go with the tutorial, I guess. I don't know. <laughs> I think it said something about generic Sonic is the only one that works, and I should choose that. Launch. I don't know what the controls are, though. Whoa! Oh, it works with the pad. Whoa! Oh, it's like an actual, like, Sonic model. Okay! How does he control? Yeah, I'm just gonna use this. Alright, let's build up some momentum and shit. Alright. Alright. Oh. For a fan game, this, I mean, it doesn't feel quite like normal Sonic games, but it feels, whoa. How do I, I don't remember what the button was for that. Jump. Uh, to crouch. Okay, well, what if I'm not, what if I'm using a gamepad? How do I crouch? Oh, B. There we go. Oh. Okay, cool. It's a lot like, uh, it's kind of like Sonic Generations, actually. Oh, no! Shit, alright. Yeah, the... Controls aren't quite as fluid as actual Sonic games, but I gotta say, so far this is... This feels pretty good, actually. I like the music, too. Very reminiscent of a lot of the more uh, newer modern stuff. Alright, what do we got over here? What the hell are those? Are those enemies? Placeholder enemies? Yep. Ah, I love them. The homing attacks probably one of my favorite things about Sonic. Aside from, you know... The obvious, he's running fast. Also, remember, remember that thing I tell you about me being be Wait, what's this? How do I boost? Boost. Uh... Not the B button. X button. X button to boost. Yep. How long can I boost for? Is it charge over time? There's a gold ring. All right, that's pretty cool. And it's got the ah, oh, it feels like an actual Sonic game. Oh, this is great. Yeah, B, that's not bad. All right, cool. How do I uh? What about that? How do I get out of there? Enter. Oh. Oh, it brings me back here. Okay. All right. All right. Let's. I've now I've heard this place only has one level. Um, aside from the tutorial, of course, and I think it's only gonna have the one level. But uh, I don't know. I'm looking forward to it. Havoc Harbor. I'm a. I'm an admiral. We, we go to harbors from time to time. Let's do this. Ooh. All right, we're already in it. Ooh, I like this music. Oh my God! No way! It's Metal Harbor! Ba da da da! Ba da 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 Oh, I love this. This is this is great. Whoa. Wow, this has a lot of work put into it. What's over here? Is this just backwards? I think this is just backwards. Oh wow. Is there a bound attack? No. Okay. Just just homing attacks and stuff. All right, cool. I guess if I head back here, then I can probably try and get back up. Okay. I hit the bombs. Give me back my rings! No! No! I couldn't pick them back up! Why? Where do I... How do I... Where do I go? Do I just run around this, I guess? Oh, yeah, and I can just get back over to here. Cool. 
hit. I'm gonna probably rerun through the level and try and see if, if I can get uh, a really good time or something. Um, we'll figure it out. <laughs> oh my God, this is. It, it feels like a real Sonic game. This is this is fantastic. I like it. Oh, whoa! Oh, he even put in like that that thing. So a lot of the new modern games have been trying to like switch between 3D and 2D, and I guess oh wow, I guess he wanted to add that in. Cool. That's pretty sweet. I like it. I mean, I've never been a fan of this. I, I wish they would just stick to 3D in the new modern Sonic games, but I'll take it. Fucking bomb dudes. This is one of my favorite songs from Sonic Adventure 2. So I'm so happy that this is what he chose as the. Uh, I didn't think it was gonna be actually. I thought it was gonna be custom music, but you know what? I'd rather this. I would much rather this because it's a safe choice. It's a. It's a song that everyone. Ooh. It's a song that everyone knows. It's a song that I. I hope everyone likes. I liked it. Um. And you know, if he had tried to do custom songs, he might have done something that maybe people wouldn't have liked and wouldn't have gone well. Is this just a dead end? I, I came up here for nothing. And, you know, I, you gotta do what you gotta do to make people like it sometimes, you know? And, whoa, wait. Is that supposed to be a Triforce? Am I supposed to be doing something over here, or like... Ah, here we go. Here's, here's the bumper. Oh! Okay. Let me just get these real quick. I like the little sound effects too, that's pretty nice. Dash on up. This makes me really want to go back down and play... Whoa, found a bug, I think? Oh, 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 what's happening? I broke it! Run, Sonic! Get away from the bugs! Run! Run! Oh, it feels good to be playing something. There we go, back to this. I was actually, I actually recently just watched the, I can't move very well right here. I just watched the Pro Jared uh, review of Sonic Adventure 2. And uh, there were, there we go. There were a few things I agreed with that he said and a few things that I didn't like. Um, one thing that he had said, though, was the uh, the loops in recent Sonic games. They used to, in the old games, be just like... Uh, ragdoll physics! Sonic is ragdoll physics! Okay, that's good. I like that. <laughs> um, one, one thing that... Oh, shit. These are the enemies. I forgot. One thing that he had said was that uh, the loops in the old games used to happen, like, instantly. And in the newer games, they've been like wanting to show off that it's like a crazy feat that he's doing, and it just makes it slow and not as impressive. And uh, that loop right there just kind of reminded me of that, and it just was like, yeah. All right, let me see if I can get this loop right. All right. I don't think jumping is. Oh no! Okay. This level. Oh shit! There are red rings here. I haven't gotten a single one. I'm probably not going to get any of them. This feels really good. Like this is, I recommend. Please, everyone, check this out. I'm gonna, I'm gonna look up who who made this. Oh, uh, because I gotta, I gotta at least say their name in this. This is fantastic. It's amazing. Like the the, the fact that this is a fan game is amazing. Like I I would never imagine that a fan could make a game like this without actually, like, working at SEGA after having been a fan or something. Like, as far as I know, this is just some guy that likes Sonic and said, I want to make a Sonic game. And you know what? It's fantastic. He did a great job. Um, I, I highly doubt it, but uh, whoever made this, if you're watching right now, dude, I, 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 think, I think I read something in, in the description on, on Game Girl that you said there was only going to be like the one level because of like complications in your life or something. Should you get the opportunity, make another one. Oh my god, this is amazing. I love it. Oh, shit. The only thing I'm not liking is that I don't seem to be able to pick up rings afterwards. But, uh, 
You know what, dude? Aside from that, it's fucking great. I'm gonna try and run through this again and see if I can get a better score, because I'm pretty sure I'm gonna get a bad score. Watch. Oh! Oh, it actually didn't do as bad as I thought. I got a B. Cool. All right. Am I, uh, am I like on a ship or something, ready to go? I'm gonna I'm gonna run through it again. I'm gonna give it another playthrough. Weird. All right. So I'm pretty sure these don't work. Whatever modern and Sonic and classic Sonic are, generic apparently does. I don't want to do the story. I want to go to the actual level. I'm not gonna try and get red rings because I doubt I'll find them. But I am gonna try and get a better score. Now that I've played through the level, I can try and do better. Like, now that I realize those are enemies, I, di I didn't even, like, pay attention to them before. Alright, let's see how far we can get through here. You know a, a game has good music if you just want to sing along with it, even if it's just inner instrumental? If you're sitting here just doing that, it's good music, and you're into it. <laughs> ah, shit. I didn't go this way before. I don't know where I am. Where am I? Ooh, the camera got wonky for a second there. Okay, well. I'm going this way, I don't care. Shit, fucked up. Did the music just start over? Had, had, was it doing it that whole time before? And maybe it was just like such a short loop that it had to like start over? And I didn't notice before for whatever reason? I just, it's such a good song. I think the only one that gets me more pumped, actually, this one probably gets me the most pumped out of Sonic Adventure 2. But uh, the only one that I might like more is probably Escape from the City. Because who doesn't, who doesn't just love that song? What are those noises that I keep hearing? Like, weird, like, timer sounding things. It's weird, I don't know what it is. There we go. Yeah, that's right, you threw your bombs, can't get me now, can you? What's down here? No, I'm gonna go this way. Oh, I have to go this way. Okay. Oh, I didn't want to lock on him, actually. I wanted to just jump forward. Ow. Rings. I think that's like a checkpoint, I guess. Maybe a weird custom checkpoint song sound that he put in. Let's see if I can do it. No, I can't. I'm not gonna be able to, but I will go. There we go. Get these real quick. Might as well, you know. Over here. Perfect. There we go. <laughs> uh, I did. I did find another uh, Sonic game. It was called like Sonic 3D or something. It was. It was a fan one. It wasn't that uh, Sonic 3D World that everybody knows or whatever it's called for uh, Sega Saturn, I believe. Um, it was another fan game that I saw. I'm gonna play it eventually. Um... Faster! Gotta go fast! <laughs> um, yeah, so I'm, I'm definitely gonna be... There... Be prepared for more Sonic on this channel. There will be Sonic on this channel. It's gonna happen. Um, I, I wouldn't feel right if I didn't put Sonic somewhere. It's, it's a, it's, the Sonic series is, you know, been, it's something I've always liked. Uh, back when I was little, I used to play the original Sonic the Hedgehog on a friend's, uh, Genesis. I never actually had my own. And I'd always beg my mom, be like, because it wasn't really, like, one of my friends, it was, nope, don't go slow. It was a friend of hers who happened to have one. I'd be like, hey, can we go to that guy's house? And she'd be like, no, no, don't bother him. And I'd be like, but I, I want to play his game really bad. <laughs> Uh, and then, of course, when I got a GameCube, I saw Sonic Adventure 2 and was like, oh, I've got to play it. I played uh, Sonic Adventure 2 before Sonic Adventure 1. So when I went back to Sonic Adventure 1, it was really weird for me. But I still loved them both. They were both fantastic games. I don't care what anybody says. Um, come 
on. I want to try and at least get an A. If I can get an S, I'd be super happy, but I don't think that's going to happen. I don't think I'm going to get an S, but... An A would be nice. That'd be cool. Da, da, da. Like this. This is a cool touch. I wish he was doing the pose, but... You know what? The fan game. A. Cool. I'm, I'll accept it. An A is perfect. That's fine with me. I'll be happy with that. Alright, guys. So, that's... Uh, Sonic Lost Adventure, Havoc Harbor. I thought it was fantastic. I don't know what you guys think. I'd say definitely, definitely try this for yourself if you get, if you get a chance. It's fantastic. Especially, I mean, it it's not as good as like an actual Sonic game, but considering it's a fan game, I mean, it was, it was almost as good as a, it, it was, like, the controls in some parts were a little not quite as spot on as I would imagine. But they were still really good, and they felt like a Sonic game. It felt how it should have, and I was able to go fast, go fluid. Everything felt right. It was a lot like Sonic Gen. Excuse me. A lot like Sonic Generations, um, Sonic Color. If and if you guys like those games, check this one out. If you haven't, still check it out. It's really good. I like it. Um, I'm gonna put a link in the description. As always, you know, definitely check this one out though. I cannot stress that enough. It's so good. Um, but if this made you smile, uh, you know, throw it a like, maybe a little comment. As for the huge, remember to stay golden. And I think I'm gonna play more of this. I, I, I think I'm gonna go ahead and just play some more of this. I'll see you guys later, though. <laughs> All right.